Hello. So today we are going to create a social networking website in Node.js and MongoDB. First we are going to give you a demo of what we are going to create. This is a sign up form. You have to enter your full name, your username, email that will be used and password. Password will be stored in encrypted form and email will be unique for each account. And in login uh, we are checking email and password separately. After logging, you will be redirected to update profile page uh, where you have to update your cover photo and your profile picture. And your profile picture. And it will be saved in database as well in your folder. So it will be saved in database and we have other information. So we have date of birth, city, country, about me and all the fields that you want to put. So the profile has been updated and now you will see in your home page a uh, input box where you will enter your post whatever you will write in it you can uh, update images videos in it whatever you write and you hit post th that will be added as a post it will be refreshed automatically and on page refresh it will show the latest post uploaded by you by your friends by the groups that you have joined and by the pages uh, from the pages that you have liked you can like any post and it will toggle the like button so next time you hit the like button it will unlike the post next we have comments you can put your comments on every post and they will be displayed like this you can see the name of uh, the person who posted the comment the time when he posted and you can share the post as well and when you share a post it will be displayed on your timeline and on your wall too we will come to the wall section later so this is the original post and this was the shared post next we have pages you can create page uh, while creating a page you have to enter the you have to select the cover photo of page the name of page domain it is optional and additional information like the description of the page you hit save and the page will be created you will see your created pages on right side you will also see the total number of likes that the page has got and on clicking the title you will be re redirected to the page detail page and in this page you can post in that specific page I am going to write this post as a post in that page only the creator of page can create posts now I am going to create a group same I have to select the cover photo of group and I have to select the name and additional information like description set any description and hit save and the group will be created and you will see your all created and joined groups on clicking you will be redirected to group detail page and whatever you post here will be submitted in group post so that will be visible only in that group it will be refreshed automatically and also it will be saved in database as well now here you will uh, see your all liked pages which pages you have liked on clicking same you will be redirected to page detail page and we have friends page where all your friends will be displayed and you can search for your friends but for now I'm going to create another account so I can make two friends and let them chat with each other set any unique email address and the password it will be saved in hash as well and I am going to log in with the newly created email and 
same I am going to select his cover photo and his profile image the profile image has been updated and this account does not has any page liked and does not join any group so I'm going to select uh, I'm going to search for some pages and for some groups I'm going to I'm I can like the page from here and same when you click on it it will be redirected to page detail page and now I can see the post from that page and if I dislike that page then I will no, no longer be able to see post from that page so I have disliked that page and now the wall is empty but I am going to again like that page search for its name and like from here Now comes to the friends part. I am going to search a friend by his name and I am going to send in my friend request. So I am going to log in with that account in another browser. and I can see his notification I can accept it and now he, he will be added in my friends and I can chat with him using inbox and you will see as soon as I send a message I do not have to refresh the page the new messages will automatically be displayed here I am using sockets for this so following this tutorial you will be able to use sockets in your Node.js project so I do not have to refresh the page. New messages will be automatically connected and displayed using sockets. And they are saved in database as well. So whenever you refresh the page next time, they will be displayed here. And now I can see my friends posts as well. I can like them, I can comment on them and your other friend will see the notifications as well so i have ex uh, accepted his friend request and the next person is automatically notified right now i have just liked my own post so i'm going to join a group Whenever I send a request, it will be sent to the group admin. He will have the authority to accept or reject any request to join the members of group. And whenever I refresh this page again, you will see the members will have number two because a new member has been added in this group. And now he will be able to post as well. And the post from that group will be displayed on his wall as well. The last thing remaining is the user profile page. You can click on user profile and you can see his profile page and all his uh, update uh, uploaded posts. Same goes for group. You can click on group and see all the posts in that group. And same goes for page. You will see page on your wall while clicking you will see all posts posted in that page so we are going to create this website in node.js and mongodb from scratch and in next video we will start the project